Doris Payne for me is someone who manipulates people. I mean, that's her job. If you know the jewelry robbery world, she certainly would be in the Hall of Fame. Payne admits to stealing expensive diamonds from all around the world, including Paris, Monaco, and Tokyo. Well, a notorious jewel thief has struck again. She's so famous, her life story is about to become a movie starring Halle Berry. Doris is a protagonist and the antagonist in the screenplay that Doris Payne writes herself every day. When I'm preparing to go on a campaign, I'm preparing to play the part of somebody else. I take a, a 10 and a half carat out of Monte Carlo. In Cartier? Uh -huh. Wow. <laughs> There's never been a day that I went to steal that I did not get what I went to do. When I go shopping with Doris, I tell her, if you take anything, let me know. And I'd say, put that back. If she sees something she wants, she will go and get it. And me, you, Jesus wouldn't stop her from doing it. You cannot be in Saks Fifth Avenue. Well, the judge did closet. not say that. Well, there is a court order, and I verify that through your probation officer. She has made a lifelong career out of stealing and taking advantage of people. It is time for her to go to prison. It is time for her to pay that price. I just want you to watch what the jury is going to see. They want you to plead guilty to burglary and take three years in state prison. Absolutely not. This is a matter of the people versus Doris Payne. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do right now and I can be persuaded. I don't have any regrets about stealing jewelry. I, I regret getting caught.